This right here is a rewash. Still got quite a bit in it, but I'm gonna try to experiment with that. I got this real gooey gooey stuff. I cannot do diamond run stuff. Drop it in there and see if I can get that sucker to dissolve. It's frozen, frozen, sub zero frozen right now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the lid on that and put it in my Sub-Zero, check it every three or four minutes, make sure there's no more gas built up. Because once it gets refrozen, there won't be any more gas ex escaping, so the, it'll be safe. Little experiment there. So I went ahead and put that my, on my dry ice because it's real bubbly, bubbling real bad. So we'll see if I can get it to slow down a little bit before I put it in my freezer. Alright, I'm second one I'm gonna put in there. This stuff right there. Diamond run that did not make. It's real sticky, gooey and gooey, so add it to the other one. That's equivalent to one pound. going to expand a little bit in that freezer because that's still warm this that stuff I put in there fell diamond run see it's going to gas off a little bit so I'll come back every two three minutes check my lid a little experiment of some two diamond runs that did not make anything so I'm going to read, read I use a can of BHO gas Let's see if I can get this to make instance of shatter. So beans, I still got dry ice. I'm gonna bring this stuff I'm trying to remake, put it on dry ice, and I'll come back and check it. And once it stops bubbling, I'll put it back in my sub zero. All right, I'm redoing my mistakes. Put my last two failed diamond runs that did not make any diamonds, could not make shatter out of it. So I redissolved it into one can of BHO gas, put in sub zero. About six to seven hours later, it dissolves. I stirred it up and I'm gonna let it settle to the, everything settle to the bottom, to see if there's any fats or waxes in the bottom. Minus 12. This in here's got ice on the bottom. This is stuff that dripped out of the container. And this is my two pounds of sh uh, diamond stuff did not make. And this is my new, I'm gonna make diamonds out of this. I'm gonna leave it here in about five days. See if there's any fats or wax on the bottom. It's almost three pound, pounds of diamond run that not, did not make. So I redissolved it, used one can of butane gas. I'm gonna try to get this to where I can put it in the bag, get some nose smasher, and make some THCA isolate. Most stuff, been cooking it for three weeks, still bubbles up on me. I think it's because my stuff is so thick. It, uh, I don't think it can really make any shatter out of this because it's just so, so thick in the turf sauce. But I'm going to attempt to make some shatter out of it. Alright. This is two pounds of some diamond that did not make. So I added 
I re-blasted it using another can. That's the drip from the one pound de-waxing column. That's what it's dripping out of. I de-waxed it. It's been sitting in the freezer for a couple weeks. I'm trying to make this to where I can put in my nug smasher. Make some THCA isolate. Someone was telling me my last pound run of shatter I made. It's almost not quite snap and pull. Uh, someone told me that it's too high humidity and too high temperature. Uh, work hard, play hard told me. So I'm doing half brush or half vacuum. Very low temperature. He said low and slow to make true shatter. He said humidity will mess it up. Anyway, give me a like. Please subscribe.